All right, you already know what time it is. It's time for mother. <laughs> Shit, I didn't get that one. See, I gotta do that better. It's time for mother. Fucking <laughs> blog, my niggas. Yo, so peep this, yo. This blog right here is serious for me. Like this one, I gotta get to the nitty gritty with this one, yo. I'm sorry, but what I noticed is. I'll see a uh, certain black artist do this, right? And it, it pisses me off. Like, they'll see white artists, right, in hip hop, and they'll be so quick to be like, oh, that's cultural appropriation. You're in our culture, and you're doing this and that, and this is what we created, and blah, 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 blah. That's how I look at you niggas when you do that. You know why I look at you niggas like that? I'm gonna tell you exactly why, because you will let so many black artists within the culture come in who who have never been part of the have nots, who've never been on the block, never never stepped foot in the hood, never been part of no static, no nothing, never held no guns, never got uh, arrested, never had nothing when it comes to nothing. They're they're good fucking kids and you let them get away with oh i put the hammer to you i let it go brat i pull out the glizzy spin the block blah blah blah, blah. niggas you niggas won't do shit <laughs> hey nigga you won't do a damn thing so like knock it off my niggas knock it the fuck off You've never held a gun before, but you love to appropriate the hood. You love talking about hood shit. Now I get it. The 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 whole hip hop culture has always been, you know, that whole tough thug image. We get it in, blah blah. I get that. But you, Kanye, made it cool for you to be you, my niggas. Came out with the pink polo, blah blah. He made it cool to be you. Stop it. If you're not from the hood, stop acting like you're from the hood. Just be a good kid. Bro, for all the years I've been rapping, I used to walk around with a gun, my nigga. I've got arrested. I've had a gun pulled out on me twice for a nigga to have even this. I should be able to rap about this gun shit and I don't even do that. I don't even brag or glorify hood shit. It's just not cool, my niggas. With, like, I thought hip hop was to get out of that, to 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 uh get past that. But it seems like whether, whether we're talking about battle rap, motherfuckers love glorifying the hood like it's cool. It's not cool, my niggas. It's never been cool. I, and you know what I've noticed? I've even noticed this just migrating into the YouTube world. I've seen like these niggas love talking about fake gun bars. They, they, gun bars galore. And I know it's like one of those things. Well, the battle rappers do it. It's just entertainment. It's not just entertainment, my nigga. The, my homie I used to rap with got shot with a shotgun dead. Dead. On my life, dead, shot with a shotgun. And what, that's cool? That, that, that's cool to rap about? Like, oh, I pull out the, 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 it's not cool, bro. When I used to, when me and my cousin first was like, yo, we getting this, 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 this jammy jam, we walking around with this. You know why? Because I feared for my life, bro. I dead was, I didn't want to get jumped. I didn't want to walk around my neighborhood and feel like, damn, niggas is going to jump me. I'm not letting nobody jump me, so I'm carrying this joint. I'm, shit, I might not have to know how to use it, but I'm sure going to scare some motherfuckers with this shit. It was, it, it was, that was the only reason. Now, I'm not going to say a part of me wasn't influenced by music like, yo, 50 said he copped this shit, so shit, I'm doing that too. But a big part of it was like, yo, I'm not letting up motherfuckers just run up on me and and treat me like I'm some little bro, bro. It's not going to happen. But you niggas, you've never done anything street in your life. You're good kids, bro. Be a 
good kid. It's okay to be a good kid. It's okay. Nobody's knocking you for this. Jaden Smith, perfect example of a good kid, comes from a wealthy family. And he, he wears that like a fucking badge of honor. Just because you've seen this movie does not mean it's your life and it's okay to rap about it. All right? It's not okay to rap about it. It's not because there's there's motherfuckers out there who are really going through this. They're really struggling. They really have to, when when the shots go off in the projects, they got to duck, my nigga. Or they got to worry about, damn, I don't want to get, got to stay off this block. I'm going to take the long way home. Motherfuckers really going through this. And you put it in your raps as if it's just this, uh, it's just entertainment. It's no, my nigga, that's not cool on any level. And you cornball fans who sit there and support it, like, oh, yeah, I listen to it because he's in the... It's because you're at the comfort of your fucking home. And you're probably a nerd, my nigga. Never been through shit in your life, so you could just listen to the music like, yeah, he's rapping about guns and pistols. And he, he ain't never did that. Instead of you just being a real solid motherfucker, like, I'm not supporting that bullshit. I might not be from the hood, but I'm not supporting that when when I know damn well you ain't from the hood. I don't give a fuck how clever your bars are, how cool you think you are, or because you're black, you think you could just rap about the hood and hood shit when you've never been around the, 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 the environment at all. If you've never been in a project, seen pissy elevators, the, the, uh, the fucking... Glass doors with the bullet bullet holes in the glass. If you've never seen that, keep it out of your vocabulary. Keep it out of your raps. Just, just stop it. You're good fucking kids. So be good fucking kids. And you fans who support this shit, knock it the fuck off. It doesn't make you cool when you listen to a nigga, oh, he's rapping about guns, so I guess this means I'm, I'm kind of part of the hood too. No, my nigga. It means you're fucking stupid. You niggas are corny, bro. Like, I'm I'm sorry. You niggas are just so corny to me. Like, just knock it off with the with, with the corny, like, supporting fake artists with the, oh, we let off the hammers. No, you niggas are corny, all right? Period.